It was a hectic scene outside the federal courthouse this morning after a woman was hit trying to cross the street. News Channel 5's Kimberly Davis spoke with the woman and has more from where it happened. Kimberly, she's just lucky to be alive. Carrie, that's right, and thankfully that driver wasn't speeding or this could have ended badly. Just take a look at how busy Broadway is and imagine trying to cross this busy street all while the sun is still rising. I stand there and I always look to the left and look to the right to see if any cars is coming for I even go across the street. But this time it was the driver that did not see Deborah Pendergrass as she was crossing the street. A uh, car came from out of nowhere to the left of me. And next thing I know, I, I was on the ground. It hit me and I was on the ground. Pendergrass was rushed to Vanderbilt University Medical Center just before 6 o'clock Friday morning. It's hurting Ooh. <laughs> all across, all across in here. The stroller is swollen. And a normal day at the office turned into a nightmare. Lots of pain. My left leg up in the, the thigh area is really bruised and sore. The shoulder is swollen down the lower part of my back is bruised. Pendergrass doesn't remember much, but she remembers the driver's voice at the scene. He even was saying, are you okay, are you okay? I didn't mean to do it, I didn't see you, I didn't see you. That's all he kept saying, I didn't see you. She was released from the hospital with some bumps and bruises. I feel blessed. <laughs> it really could have been worse. But Pendergrass says she's just happy to still be alive. Oh, of course, I was scared. I thought of my life was flashing in front of me. I was like, oh Lord. So I had to start praying real quick. <laughs> Now, Pendergrass hopes something can be done about this. Maybe they need to put something out there for a pedestrian like they have down by the state buildings. They have those signs put up where they're telling them to slow down because of the pedestrian when the pedestrian's in. That might help. It may not stop the accidents, but it may make it a little safer to cross the street. I knew that somebody was going to get hit one day out there, but I didn't think it was going to be me. Now that driver was issued a ticket for failure to yield to a pedestrian while in the walkway and police are telling us that the traffic lights were still flashing yellow at that hour. For now, we are live in downtown Nashville. I'm Kimberly Davis, News Channel 5.